Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to another video. Today we will be playing a, or doing a Minecraft tutorial how to build a wood mansion. Um, so if you enjoy today's video, like, subscribe, and hit that bell for more content. Let's get into it. Alright, to start off with, you're going to have one concrete there. Then you're going to go one, two, three, four, there. Fill that in right there. Then go two over and repeat like that after doing that do a two three four five six ten more and then just go repeat that on the other side and then make it a four high two three build up three blocks after that so it's a four high or a three high and then just surround, do the walls walls like that leave this space open the whole time don't do that just leave it open so then you just do this real quick. By the way, um, comment down below what you want me to build next in Minecraft. Do that. I know you have that kind of garage there. We'll do the interior last. So then you'll get your oak logs go up like this. Don't do that. I'm just using them as blocks. And then get rid I'm going to get rid of them after. Or make it go one higher than the Or actually don't do that. Go make it at the same height so this there. And then get if you had to place blocks get rid of them under. I know it, does, it looks like they're floating, but then do that. And if you want, you can have it like this and fill it in like that. Because that's what I'm going to do. I like it better like that. Um, so, after you do that, fill in this top little piece here. Like this. fill in the whole floor with wood because the house is wood it's gonna look like stone on the outside so yeah. be ready for that okay And once you're done with that, you're gonna get these oak logs that you get, and you're gonna go up by one and do that. Um, yeah, that's blocking all the concrete, so. I know it looks a little weird, but, yeah, trust me. Oh, and if you have torches, I would probably put them in here so monsters don't spawn. Unless you have it on peaceful. I'm not gonna make, eh. If you want, you can place them how you want. Because I'm going to do one there, one there. Wait a minute, I put it in the wrong way. Alright, that's how it's going to look. And if you want, you can place like one there. I don't know. However you want your garage to look like. But I'll do the interior, so I don't know. And now for the garage floor, you're going to want to get rid of all the dirt. So, 
after you get this all done, you're gonna fill the floor in with the, the smooth stone. All this is gonna be smooth stone. So after you get that put in, I'll show you when I'm done here. There we go. One side's done. I don't, I'm not gonna show you how to build a car. So, uh, you can put like whatever you want in here. Storage space. This garage could be a storage space, like I said, instead of a garage, but it's what you choose. It could be, it's all up to you. If you want it storage space, uh, you would go like that. Like this, but with the logs like that. Every two and put chests in. That would make it look nice. And if you want, you could do that. That's only, actually that looks nice. We'll add that in. A little storage space on the side. But. I'm using infested stone because I couldn't find the stone, so. Alright. And there we go. Like that. So, you're just gonna continue here like that around the sides I don't you go like this if you want like that but if this is this is if it's going to be a storage space so in this case it's going to be a storage space for me so I might look a little funky in here but I could fit a tour something chest there just a couple there so after you get all those placed for my storage space there won't be a garage if you do this method so just beware of that So if you got that done, if you want interiors last, like I said, so uh, you're gonna want to bring out your stone or quartz, quartz. Get your quartz out, block of quartz, and then you get buttons, stone buttons. And then you would put that in like that. If you're looking for a way in, uh, I'll show you, I'll make a door in the back real quick when I'm done with this. You would put them all at the top or you can put them in the middle, however you decide you want it. I like them at the top, it looks better. Like that, that's how it looks. The garage doors look kind of ugly, so if you don't like them. And then get, you're going to want stone stairs. I don't have enough in my, uh, these kind of stairs. Because you're going to be done with those, so then you get a good post where they were. They were. Not concrete, or not the wooden fence posts. You're going to get walls. All right, I'll show you what I'm trying to make here. You're 
you're gonna get these walls or whatever walls you want those are gonna be done and then you're gonna go like that and then like this and then make the door here or wherever it might not look the prettiest so beware you can do it this way wherever you want it then you can get in here and that's a nice little area to exit get in there's your storage space in here so then now that the garage is done you go up here first I would clear your inventory grab the stone again okay get everything out or just use the stone yeah just get the stone here let me find it I don't care oh yeah see I got the infested stone again so then you go up by three again or I'll show you Yeah, you go up by three. Those are my misfails over there, so I don't pay attention to those. Anyway, and then you just build up your walls like you would did in the garage. It look. I'm gonna put wood on the outside, so don't worry. And then we're gonna probably do the interior. What's for there for light? Uh, after you get a torch, you can do it like that and that. If you want to light outside, boom, boom, like that. Then you go up in your house. And obviously, if you want, you can put uh, uh, lanterns or something. And door. you can also put doors. So yeah, don't worry about that. I'm gonna do no doors because I think it looks better with no doors. So after you get this done, you're gonna put, you're gonna want uh, windows or trap doors. I'm gonna, might take me a second. All right, get this done. Um, Then if you want a chandelier, I can show you how. Then you're gonna want a roof, 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 roof. Wood, wood, wood. You're gonna do this. No, not that. This. And then you're gonna go all around. Guys, I'm struggling place these stairs I never have problems placing stairs but the one time I'm making a video I have problems pra placing them like I said before guys if you enjoyed today's video like subscribe from and hit that bell for more content like this you'll go up one more and then you'll put a roof on it or the slabs on it or blocks I don't if you want more height than slabs but if you want blocks because you already have enough height to jump then uh, logs you might not be able to make up with a, sh a chandelier or with our logs so. So, but sh I can make them oh yeah you can make a chandelier I know how so after you get this done you're you're gonna need light, and that's what the chandeliers are gonna be for. After you finish this, one, I'm almost done, so. After you do all that, you're gonna need the light, right? So then you're gonna get iron bars here, and then you're gonna get glowstone. Okay, let me. Glow stone, and then you're gonna get trap doors again. Uh, I do those, but it doesn't really matter which ones you get. That's what's gonna suck. They're gonna be right here, and they're gonna be big. So be prepared for that if you want. Oh, 
I don't personally like them. They're just too big. So that's why I'm just going to place torches. But let's say if you had that slab or a bigger ceiling, uh, then you could do those chandeliers. So if you want to change up the build some, go ahead. Alright, there you go. My torches are up, and then you could do a chandelier. One big, like, chandelier here. I wouldn't do it, but yeah. Or maybe. Let me see how it works real quick. Eh, you could if you wanted to. It doesn't look that good, but if you want a big chandelier like that, that's how you're gonna do it yeah, there's not gonna be an enchantment room in this so for the the big uh, windows you're gonna get your a frame whatever kind of windows you want if you want the the glass and then the glass pane I use glass panes so very ugly in here so we're gonna have to switch that paper out of the wall up. it's okay in here you're gonna then this is the interior so then you're gonna go down here to the wall the, the wall wherever wall you want you can switch it the wall if you want wall you place it but I'm not gonna use wool we're gonna get whatever color bed you want uh, I'll just take blue. Uh, and then you're going to place it here next to that. Then you're going to get a crafting table, a furnace. Okay, that's very loud here. Let me do a code real quick. Or uh, make it clear again. There you go. Got that like that. And then if you want you can get a, a nice painting that's too big whatever too big can I get a little one Just don't yeah there we go like that it's a nice little bedroom for you then you're gonna get your chest for your chest room downstairs here you can use item frames to label them or whatever but after you do that get two sets of chests do you got that stuff in oh, there you go after you got all those in you can that's your storage area unless you want item frames you can go here uh, go back up in the house it's gonna be pretty empty but I think you, you're gonna get your armor stand, put your armor on it. Uh, here, let me do a little cool case here. So glass for one. Need the glass, and then you're gonna need pistons. Piston, just a normal one, and then a a red uh, torch or a block or something, whatever. Whatever has redstone in it. So you'll put that there. Put whatever item frame. No, okay. I think it's better just to do that like that. <sighs> so then you get your armor frame here and do that and push them in like that. And then you're gonna wanna push the glass. It's a little bonus here. Like, 
Okay, what am I doing wrong? So it should push them into the glass. I'm not sure why it's not working though. Um, so, never mind, I thought I knew how to make it, but I don't, so. Yeah, if you can figure that out, how to push it into the glass, then you can do it, but I can't right now, so. Actually. <gasps> That's how you do it. And then you do that. There you go. Now it's completely centered in the glass cage. And let's say you want to throw some armor on that. You go at its little hand at the side here. Ooh, did I just put that on? Oh, oopsies. You're going to crowd. Are you going to go there? Alright, I cannot seem to do it. So most likely you put whatever armor you have on after. Or before. So go like. Oh. I have not used one of these things in so long. That and then you'd get your glass and nuts. And then. Hopefully it's still, yeah, all right. There you go. And now you got a fully armored little dude right there for your glass wall case. You can put that anywhere. Since I have enough space, this is gonna be the last thing. You get a jukebox, brewing, anvil. Um, and a bookshelf, an enchantment table. Alright. Oh. And then in... Enchantment tables right there. And then you're gonna go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Or three, go up by two or whatever, how many bookshelves you want. That looks the best to me. You can have your, I'll fix that hole. You can have your jukebox right there, right there, anvil there. And then you can put your brewing stand on the anvil. Like that. Um, you, if you find more stuff to add to it, you can add that. Um, but... Other than that, guys, I think that's going to be the end of today's video. So, if you guys enjoyed today's video and the tutorial and you like and you subscribed. Well, I'm sorry it's not wood, but it's stone. So, yeah. Uh, if you guys liked, uh, if you guys liked today's video, like, subscribe, hit that bell. And if you enjoy it, if you want more content like this. Well, come check out my channel every day. Alright? Bye!